Our world right now is often telling us to X out anyone that doesn't love you the way you need to be loved or doesn't check all the boxes for being the type of friend or the type of parent or the type of sister that you, you personally need to have. And I learned a really great lesson. Um, when someone in my life was difficult and I thought, well, this is an unhealthy relationship. And pretty immediately the spirit said, this isn't an unhealthy relationship. This is a learning relationship. And I think it's really important for us to distinguish the two because there are unhealthy relationships that we should probably move away from. But I think more often than not, most of them are just learning relationships. And now instead of saying, oh, I, this person shouldn't be in my life, I ask Heavenly Father, what am I supposed to learn from this person being in my life? And as I continue to do that, you know, there's relationships that I, maybe they weren't filling every need for me and I could have X'd out a long time ago. Mm -hmm. But looking back, who I've become because of that relationship and then the relationship I have with those people that I've let stay in my life and I've worked for that relationship, um, I'm so grateful. And I would hate to have a life without them because at one point in my life, they weren't exactly who I needed them to be. And then on further self-reflection, how many people would have exed me right. out of their life <laughs> because I wasn't exactly who they needed me to be. Yeah. And I'm just, I think we need to do a lot more grace and understanding and really working. There's a reason why Heavenly Father put us in families and neighborhoods and wards. Yeah. We need to become the people who are ready for those celestial relationships. And we're not gonna do that by having everybody be exactly who we're supposed to be yeah. so we never have to grow or change.